Hey gang, welcome back to the channel. So today I am outside Neptune home in Nutford. Now I've just drove up here. Now I've never been here before, so I am a bit of a um, newbie shopper to Neptune. Obviously I've heard about it and all things like that, so it's not like I don't know it. Um, I've just actually never been to one of these showrooms, so I'm really, really excited. I'm a little bit nervous though because I don't know how they're going to be with me filming. So whether I get any content on my camera, I don't know. It might all be on my phone because I go to pieces like in shops and stuff. And this is like, I feel very posh. And it was like really sunny in Liverpool when I left. And I've got here, it's been raining on the way and I've got shorts on, so <laughs> I don't think they're going to be very um, very impressed with me, I'm not going to lie. I was literally driving up here and I was surrounded by G-Wagons and I was thinking, <laughs> and literally the houses were unreal, like there was pure like, um, like estates, like as big as my road like to drive up to them so i was literally in my element looking at all the gorgeous houses on the way so it's in a really gorgeous area and um, i'll just show you can you see it properly i don't know i'm trying to zoom in it's not working but yeah anyway i don't know how they're going to be about filming so we shall see and then i think this is going to be kind of like a bit of a vlog style video i'm thinking of going to um home Sense after here the one in cheadle i think it's like 25 minutes away um i obviously have been to that one before and my old manager um he work he's the manager there so i might see him so yeah i'm thinking of popping there so i think this will be kind of like a bit of a vlog um so by the way i don't like flavored water but this is from Marxies lemon and lime um still water and it's gorgeous it's 75p for this big bottle and you know like when you get like flavored water and there's that like weird like bittiness you know what i mean like like phlegmy you don't get that with this so i love it but yeah anyway i don't know why i'm news i'm nervous you know what the hell people are starting to look they're on to me they're on to me i just need to build my confidence i think because i've had so many like recording with the camera no one realise like it is difficult you know like it's such a big thing like people like when you're in like London and things it's like the norm but when you're like around here and things I think people think oh fresh got a pure camera out but like I just have had a few knockbacks over over the past course of being a vlogger so I just need to build my confidence and just like whip my camera out and not be ashamed together um I think as well because it's quite posh isn't it and I'm far, let's be honest, I'm far from that. Okay, enough of me stressing. Let's just go in. gorgeous i love these baskets under the console as well and this lamp is beautiful 180 pounds that's gorgeous i love these plants as well so pretty it's all in here in a bathroom don't usually think of stuff like that love the style as well how gorgeous is this sink yeah i've had to put my glasses on by the way because i can't see um oh they're fab as well 70 pounds you know when you feel like you need to whisper it's kind of one of them that's gorgeous as well love that i love the style and it's so so pretty how gorgeous is it I feel like I'm in someone's house, it's so clean and beautiful. Oh, I love these jars. What a fab idea. They just store all your stuff and it just looks so pretty here and I love this as well. And it's sustainable, even better. There's some gorgeous bits, but look at this behind me. So, is this? kitchen it is absolutely gorgeous and i am obsessed with those boards the texture on them is so pretty i love the marble worktop and the sink it's working i will not be touching that no 
I literally can't cope. <gasps> wow. It's literally like being in somebody's house. <laughs> no, this is literally like the dream kitchen. <gasps> Look at them lights. Do you know what this reminds me of? Like Olivia Millen's home. <gasps> no. I am obsessed. dream of a tea coffee area like this. That's gorgeous. I'm obsessed. I love this cooker and hob. I love it. I don't usually like old fashioned stuff but I really really like that one. Just even like the style and elements here are fab as well. And these chairs are fab as well. I just love all like the little detailing in them as well. And that rug over the back of the chair, 140 pounds. I mean, I know it's a bit pricey, but obviously it's gorgeous to come and get some inspiration. <gasps> How pretty is it used? I love that as well. That's probably like restaurant here, I don't know whether I like that. But yeah, I love this. And that lamp is so gorgeous, love that shade. Let's go through to the office. But first, let's divert into this bedroom. Wow. <laughs> That is gorgeous. How cosy is that? I am honestly obsessed with this room. It's so gorgeous. <gasps> Look how soft they are. I love them. And they are gorgeous. I love a glass piece. <laughs> feel like I need to whisper in here, I don't like it. Well, that's like my desk chair. I love that. That's so nice. The fast is gorgeous as well. I really do like that wallpaper though. Super. <laughs> so stunning. I love like the sagey green um, blue on the back wall. You can't really see it well on the ca on the camera but the sofas match as well and you can't again see it because of the lighting but they're like a sage green sofa. Thinking at these are multiple finishes but I'm not too sure but imagine that being the view out you got. <laughs> like amazing and you know what I spotted this in here as well. <gasps> How gorgeous is that? If I haven't found it online, I'll let you know. Don't know whether they can open this. I'm scared. No, I'm scared to break anything in here, you know. And they had them in Home Sense as well. Now you can actually um, shop all the stuff here. I love this glass lamp. But yeah, you can shop all the stuff here. I've spotted a few bits that I've seen in like obviously cheaper stores if you don't want to pay out, which is understandable. But obviously it is really high um, class pieces, so they are investment pieces if you come to like an expensive place like this. I love this bar cart as well. Oh, there it is. This is it. It is gorgeous. This has been on my wish list for the longest time. It's a gorgeous drinks dispenser, and you can have it on show. And if you do it, for oh my god, there's that style of Pokemon as well. <gasps> 
if I see anything, I'll leave um, um, things linked that I've seen, you know, like stuff like this and books and things where I haven't found it for years. But honestly, I'm obsessed with that. I think that might be on a more at home as well, but I'll, as I say, I'll link anything. But gorgeous style, and I'd love like a bar trolley in like my extra room. <laughs> you know, it looks so, so nice. I love that stool as well. It's just nice to get like really nice ideas. I love the styling as well. They remind me of chess pieces. And they've got the cereal magazine as well. Doesn't that look really nice? <laughs> what am I like pulling it out? But it's just really, really nice. I like a double leveled um, coffee table. Just adds more dimension to your space. I also love the double um, rail as well. Um, in Red Row, so Red Row Homes, they just have a singular one, but they like put an extra piece here, you know, so it looks like you've got two curtains, but in here they do like the thinner foily style ones, and then obviously your thick ones for the evening, but I like the double um, rail, it's nice. <laughs> doing lime green against the marble <gasps> I love it and I love this as well just everything about it do you know what the contrast between the lime green and the whitey cream and the white I would never have thought of well I think this is more of like an off-white but it's absolutely gorgeous I love the handle I love the handles on the Neptune kitchens I really do everything that they've got by the way is obviously priced for you as well and again there's another hob oven that's like an old fashioned one it's gorgeous and I love the styling as well I just love all the different like textures and elements like the wood against the marble against the cream and then the lime green I would never have thought of lime green <laughs> I really like that I'm sure I can't bear wearing glasses because when you've got makeup on you see them lines you get absolute nightmare so anyway what did you think of neptune home it was so quiet in there i felt like i had to whisper you know when i was recording as nerve-wracking as i thought and they seemed to be okay with me filming and um, but it was so like tippy toey but that kitchen the first kitchen was absolutely amazing do you see them hanging lights they reminded me a bit like oh my god it's sweating in here. so overall pretty impressed i think it's really nice in there it's great for inspiration on a nice little day out and um, they should do like a little coffee shop in there i think unless there's one next door and i just haven't noticed i'm not too sure and um, the stuff in there is a little bit pricey so if you are wanting something on a budget i think it's definitely the place for inspiration and then maybe hopping online if i do see anything that i've seen in there online for cheaper i'll link it below of course you know me um but honestly it's gorgeous and the kitchens i feel like now i've decided on my dream kitchen that second one like the finish on it and that pantry wow unreal but anyway um we're gonna drive to home sense now the one in Cheevil. i think it's like half an hour so i hope it doesn't start raining again because on the way it was a bit of an annoyance um so yeah let's drive to home sense i'm so excited to go to home sense you know I'm just so excited. Oh, you know this brings back so many memories. I've literally not been to this home since, since like before lockdown. I did um, come and wear here in this store, like literally like four weeks before lockdown. So when was that like? 2020 like that's ages ago it's like two and a half years so i'm really excited to see the store how it's laid out and things like that like i just love coming to different home centers anyway because obviously i usually go to the entry one so this is like an hour's drive from there but this is the best one little home center inside but this one gets sent all the best bits due to the area and whatnot and um, if you want to know any more like home sense spill the tea i've actually got a video um telling you all a few a few home sense secrets so make sure to check that out if you're interested um but yeah anyway i'm really excited to go in i mean i hope there's some gorge bits i am in the mood to shop no use this is actually my favorite ever home sense it is massive there's so many unreal pieces i'm literally obsessed like 
I just love it. I love this table. It's gorgeous. The merchant's gorgeous. I love the way they put stuff on the top. I was never allowed to do that. This is nice, isn't it? How much is that? Two nine nine. Gorgeous. You know what though? Since like lockdown, I reckon they have an half of the price. Oh gosh. There's a barbecue. Hey. Mad love that. I am literally not over this store. There's just so many unreal bits. I love all these pots. This is gorgeous. We've actually got that and I've got it in the bigger size as well. And I love these as well. They're so cheap. 10 99 What a bargain. 7 99 I love the texture on that. I spotted these planters as well. These plant pots are stunning. They're £90. But honestly, the texture, the they're just so sturdy and durable. They're definitely worth the money. And there's two. You never get thousand pounds but I'm not being funny we've literally just seen something so similar in Neptune home for like well more it's absolutely gorgeous I love the way it cheers it fits um six but I reckon it'll fit more around it you know we've got stools on I absolutely love them. oh my god look how unreal these prints are I really want that one literally I think they're only 70 quid what a bargain and then there's another one with a girl with flowers and she's gorgeous, that's fab, and that is gorgeous. How quirky is that? I don't know what's behind it, it's the same one. What have they got here? Well, that's nice as well, £50. Do you know, i seen someone on Instagram bought that. It's very um, Sophie Patterson. It's giving me very Sophie Patterson interiors vibes. Really love these as well. I love the frame on them, and I love the print inside. They're the same, no different. They'd be gorgeous in like a lounge or a bedroom. I'm really loving this kind of like linen textured artwork. It's really nice. Well, that's nice as well. It's got the texture and the sort of faces, you know, I like something like that. And I'm loving these prints at them in as well. They've got the, um, is it the Bath House? I can't say it properly. Um, on TK as well. I'll link them. Oh, I love him. Boss. Literally got loads of drawn ups. Honestly, there's so, so many. It's so tidy in this shop and I love this mirror as well, it's on sale for 43 Literally just so impressed with like the merchandise and the cleanliness. It's just immaculate, it's gorgeous. wonder if there's any nice frames. Oh, I love that one. That's so pretty. I usually literally have the Soho House candles. That one is gorgeous and it's on TK Maxx online as well, which is very rare so I will link it for you. They've also got the small one as well, and I've just opened this one, $29.99, the marble candle. Look at that. How gorgeous is that? I can't cope. That is so fun on interiors. Do I buy it? I'm debating on buying it. You know, Soho House is so expensive. Like, that's £30, but it's usually like £100 for that candle. And even in Bista, it was quite spenny. No use, I really want it. I am obsessed. £170. Like, I'm sorry, that's something you see in Zara and you would not be paying that cheap of a price, honestly. And look at him. £79.99. I'm obsessed. The texture on him is amazing. I would so. Do you know what? I would bring him home. Like, I'm not even messing. Oh, that cabinet is gorgeous as well. I love the finish on there. And these stools are just fab. I wonder how much they are. Can't find the price on them. I reckon they'd be about 70 quid. And then this is giving me very Kelly Hoppin sheepskin fair boucle vibes. Let me see how much it is. This is a price. 59.99. That is gorgeous. Oh, I love this as well. It's a really gorgeous. 250 pounds. Like, I don't know, like hallway stool, you know, if you've got a big hallway, sometimes them little stools, like, to put your shoes on and that can look a bit crap. Um, but it'd be nice in, like, a reading room or something like that as well. There's so many chairs, loads of them bootleg ones that I've seen in my last home since vlog. Um, but this is nice as well. This is giving me very English garden vibes. That'll, that'll fly out. Oh my god, I love these. So these are candles, right? This is a watermelon lemonade. But you can reuse it as a cup, which I think is really good. Oh my god, you they've got some gorgeous dining pieces. I love these silhouette face bowls, the gorge. And they've got the matching plates as well. There's actually some gorgeous dining pieces, like I'm really surprised. And these ones give me major like Ted Baker vibes. I love them. Oh, and they've got the is it Broste Copenhagen, I think that's how you say it. They've got the matte um grey plate set as well. I would definitely get that with them and the bowls, what a set that would be. They've 
got literally the whole La Cruze orange set. Now, if you are one who's a big La Cruze fan or wants the set, well, it's actually coming into autumn and this will be so, so expensive when it comes back into season. You've literally got the oven trays, the teapot, the um, cutlery holder and the butter dish. You've literally got everything in here, but the orange set is actually online. Again, I'm on the ball, aren't I? I link it. I love the blue teapot as well. I love the cruiser, it's so gorgeous. And this is gorgeous as well. Love that there. The merchandise and here you use, like you do understand, amazing. I'm obsessed with it. They smashed it. <laughs> Who am I, eh? But honestly, I love this. I know it's to burn, but I would have that for show. <laughs> you know me, everything's for show only. Oh, I love that as well. Isn't that nice? I love that. Perfect for party. I love that cabinet as well. Can you spot that at the back? I actually can't get through to it. And these are keys as well. I think the yeah, they are the trunks. Literally so many ice buckets as well. These are so expensive and like the likes of John Lewis and things, but here they're very good price and also there's copper ones. I wonder how much they are, I can't find the price. I wonder if it's underneath. Yeah, twelve ninety nine. What a bargain tonight. Colour green, isn't it? I love that. I wonder how much that is. I reckon about one thirty or one eighty. A 150 right smack bang in the middle that desk is nice as well isn't it very mod it's a strange material on the top though this is actually my favorite home sense like look at all the amazing pieces i love that there's actually so many gorgeous bits that is gorgeous i reckon you could spray that anybody wanted like maybe a cream or something if it was like the color 25 pounds give me h&m vibes but no, a bar set as well that'll be sold in no time and I love them heads. I think they're amazing. How fab was that home sense? I've literally shut the door open because I'm sweating. Um and I'm desperate for a wee as well. There's no toilets on this retail park. There was literally so many unreal things. Like, did you see them? Soho um house candles, a bargain. And they're on TK Maxx, so I've got you covered. Anything that I've showed you, I will link below because there's nothing worse than when you see something in home sense and you can't find it online. Well, no, do not fear, Elliot's here. I've also got the White Company hand wash, but it's running out, so I might actually run into town to get some more because this is actually life. I'm gonna have to. And um, my car smells amazing, by the way, as well, because I've got the White Company. You know, I love the White Company. I've got the White Company car diffuser. I am so impressed with it. Um, so if you need a new car diffuser, get on the White Company again. Everything I talk about, I'll just link for you. It's like no stress. But yeah, anyway, I'm desperate for the wee. I've got a wee belly, like. You know, you know what I mean, right? Anyway, enough of the stress. I will catch you at home. So I've just got home, right? I have never needed a way more in all my life. And I've literally just had one of these M&S Plant Kitchen cookies. Wow. It's probably all over my face, to be fair. You know what I'm like. Um, I actually haven't gone to get the Home Centre print yet. There's been a bit of a, you know, a debate in the household as to whether to get it or not. Shock. So I'm not sure whether we're going to get it, but... We've already got a print that we got from HomeSense like years ago. It's always on my Instagram. Everyone always asks where I got it from. It's from HomeSense and I've never seen it since I'll show you. This print, I'm obsessed with it. I think it was like a hundred, I think it was like 180 pounds, like 200 pounds. But honestly, it's my favourite thing in our house. But we've got a wall on the opposite side, um, which I'd like to send you prints on. But I feel like it's lacking personality, do you know what I mean? So we've been trying to find something and I felt like that print was perfect, but... There's always a debate in our household, like, there was a debate about this one, I absolutely loved it, we've got it, now everyone wants it, do you know what I mean, so, yeah, I don't know whether I'm going to pick it up, but if I do, you will be able to see it over on my Instagram, if you're not already, do make sure you're following me. I also was multitasking, I'm trying to get TikToks, all sorts, so it's been a very busy day, it's now half two, I left the house this morning, I think at like ten, and now I'm just on TK Maxx. I've literally found like most of the stuff that I've seen in store and this vlog is going live like tomorrow so it'll all probably still be on so I'll literally leave everything linked for you um, but yeah I do think that is the end of the little vlog hope you enjoyed it I definitely recommend going to Neptune Home obviously it was my first time um, I think it's more of a showroom as opposed to like and maybe like getting a kitchen as opposed to like a shopping experience if that makes sense so you can get like loads of inspiration it's really lovely i was felt really welcome and things so it was really nice i'm definitely gonna maybe go to another one i don't know whether they're all the same but i like the way it was quite like a bomb conversion kind of thing and then home since she obviously i haven't been in years and i was not 
um, disappointed. The stock was amazing, as you could see. Um, the merchandising is always top notch in that store. I always say it's the best store because it is. Oh, didn't know we had another thing was there. No wonder it's not focusing well. Um, so yeah, anyway, that was my day. I've had a ball. My glasses just leave a horrible indentation on my face. I'm just going to have to accept it. So yeah, anyway, I'm just going to get round to editing this vlog. I hope you did enjoy. Please subscribe if you're not already. But mainly absolute world. I'm nearly at 2k followers. I like saying on the channel like what I'm nearly at because I feel like when I look back I'll be like oh my god remember that so yeah that's why I always say it um but yeah anyway enough of me blabbering I'm gonna enjoy my tea and I'll catch you on the next vid